Question 6 Part A. Complete the time series graph from the table. First, we set up axes for years on the horizontal and number workers on the vertical. The first four points from 2015 to 2018 are already plotted. Now, we will plot the remaining four points. After that, we connect all consecutive years with straight line segments. Question 6 Part B. Estimate the number of workers in 2023. From 2021 to 2022, the increase is four workers. We will project a similar increase to 2023. Mark the year 2023 with an estimated value of 84 workers and draw a dashed extension from 2022. Question 7 Part A. A right cone with radius 5 cm, perpendicular height 12, and slant height 13. The curved surface area formula is pi times r times l, where l is the slant height. Beth used 12 instead of 13. That is the mistake. We draw the cone and label r equals 5, h equals 12, and l equals 13. Show the correct formula. Show Beth's substitution using 12 and highlight the 12 is wrong. Question 7 Part B. Adam estimates the area of the base using pi approximately 3. The base is a circle, so area equals pi, r squared. Substitute r equals 5. Replace pi with 3. Compute 3 times 25 equals 75 square centimeters. Question 7 Part C. Beth uses pi approximately 3.14. Is her estimate more than or less than Adam's? Because 3.14 is bigger than 3, and the area equals pi times r squared, Beth's area is larger. Tick the option more than. Question 8. Solve the linear equation 7x minus 22 equals 4x minus 29. Bring x terms to the left, subtract 4x from both sides. 3x minus 22 equals negative 29. Thank you for watching. Tap like, share, and comment, and then follow and subscribe for more quick problem solving tips. Let's make math simple. One video at a time, only on MyVerse Maths.